nope, we still have the one we still need to find. That is like severely disappointing. <laughs> And welcome to my channel. Today we're doing an episode of Jungle Adventures. So, um, we are like one treasure away from being able to complete this series. So, I mean, we're already so close. So, what I was uh, wondering is if y'all would like to see uh, Lacey and um, I was thinking the new uh, beau, Jacquin. Um, because we're just going to get him to leave his spouse. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're awful. We're doing that. Anyway. But, um... I was wondering if you guys would like to see them make an appearance in a in a uh, another series. Like in the new Let's Play I'm designing. Or if maybe maybe you really don't like Jaquin Because you think he's a, a D-bag. Because, well, he's dating Wolfgang at the same time. Anyway... Uh, if there's anybody else you'd like for us to get to know, um, go ahead and leave that down in the comments below. But we're going to go ahead and uh, make sure that she has completed all of her stuff in her life to make sure that she is as happy as is possible before she decides to uh, embark out on another uh, journey of uh, maybe finding her soulmate. Or should we do serial romantic? Because I kind of like a uh, soulmate or... Um, Hmm. Food. I don't know. We could um, go ahead and leave your suggestions down below of what aspiration we should do next. Um, I mean, I'm thinking either something from the love category, maybe something from the knowledge category, since uh, there's three more there, or maybe even doing something from the family category. Um, so, like I said, go ahead and leave your feedback uh, down below, and uh, we will go from there. So, for right now, we will. Uh, uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll do soulmate for now, uh, but then uh, we'll we'll change that once we decide where we're going with the series after uh, after Jungle Adventures is actually over. Because this has always been designed to be a mini series, so I honestly didn't even expect it to get to twenty parts. Um, so I mean, we're almost done. Like I said, she only has the one left anyway, um, which is just another frog. Yeah, it's that one. It's the only one we haven't found yet. So right now we're waiting for the uh, temple to reopen. Because if you remember from the last part, um, we had just finished out the temple. We found another frog and a plate. So now we just need to be able to uh, find the last frog. So we're just kind of having her chill and do whatever today. Since uh, the temple won't be open for I'd probably say at least another 12 hours. Um... I mean, maybe we could go explore the jungle like we did last time. I mean, that was kind of cool. We were able to find a couple of treasure chests that way anyway. Um, uh, but go ahead and take a shower, Lacey. I mean, since that's really the only thing you can actually really do. Maybe we will... Uh... Oh, and Thiago's got a spouse, too. Sp Sage's got a spouse. Zion doesn't have a spouse. At least I don't think so. Oh, uh, you could just send him a text. Uh, no. Oh, she's got a spouse. He's got a spouse. Can we, like, meet single sims around here? That'd be nice. Ah, uh, Katrina doesn't have a spouse. Nina does. Matias da doesn't. Actually, at least, at, least, at least it's not listed if he does. Um... I just, I love this little house so much. Like, I'm looking at all the little details I put in and everything. I just, I love it. Because I think, I think back to what I would like a rental to look like. Or like a hotel or whatever when I'm staying there. So that's kind of what I based it off of. So when, at least, when I stay in hotels. The, the last hotel me and my husband stayed in. It was actually a, it was pretty nice. Um, I mean, as far as hotels go. It had a fridge, and, or it had a mini fridge, it had a microwave, had the TV, um, but it also had a couch, and then also had a vanity, and then it had a separate bathroom. The only thing I did not like about this place was the toilet was so tall. I am a short person, so in order for uh, me to be able to tolerate a very tall 
toilet. I'm like, <gasps> I mean, it was awful. I literally had bruises because I, my legs were dangling over the edge. Like, and just for a little bit of context, I'm only, I'm five three. I'm very short, and then my husband's actually uh, well over six feet tall. So for him, I mean, it wasn't as big of a deal. But for me, I'm like, I'm dying. <laughs> Can we go? <laughs> But, I mean, it was nice. Uh, but anyway, and, um, but I always like seeing that kind of stuff there. I like having, like, a couch and that kind of stuff, coffee tables and stuff like that. So this way it kind of, it kind of feels a little bit more home. Plus, um, I love napping on couches. Uh, I don't get people that like to nap on a bed because I'm like, I mean, I will <laughs> it's not my first choice, though. Let's be honest. No, we're not changing into the nude. I want you changed into some appropriate jungle attire. And so, um, but anyway, um, since I love napping on couches and my husband always has to, uh, He always has to, like, sit down to, like, actually get his shoes on. So, he's one of those weird people. He actually, like, ties his shoes every time. I'm like, you're weird. <laughs> but I love him anyway. Um, but, um, I forgot where I was going with this. But anyway, so he'll, like, take up, like, a love seat to himself trying to put his shoes on. Oh my, like, it's freaking ridiculous. Um, let's see, that one's closed. Oh, what does this say? What does it say? Oh. Uh, check back in a few hours. Okay. Oh, and this one's closed. Man. Now what are we supposed to do? Maybe go up this way. Yeah, we're going to travel to the uh, Miskin Royal Baths. Why not? But yeah, he like takes up like a couch and a half. And it's like, I need more room. <laughs> So I like making sure that there's lots of places to sit down, lots of places to be comfortable. At least that's for me when I'm traveling. That's what I always want. Oh, the Spice Festival is in town. I'm like, what's that music? I have my headset turned up a little louder than I usually do, so. Who is this? Who are you? Why don't you do a, a cheerful introduction? Oh, that's really cool. I didn't know they could do that. That's really awesome. Maybe you could get to know her a little bit. Um, maybe compliment her outfit. I think it's hideous myself, but I mean, I guess you think it's all right. Ask about her love life. Why does that mean that you got in? Like, uh, where is ask if single? Is that in under friendly? Ask if single, just because I'm curious. She is single. Holy crap. It's like the first like single sim she's actually like gotten to know. Uh, splash. Aw, aren't they adorable? No, they can't really swim laps. Come on. What is a sexy pose in the water? I'm just curious. What is this? Is that it? What the hell is that? that that's a sexy pose. Did I, like, miss it all or something? Like, the hell. Alrighty. Okay, whatever. Oh, well, they're flirty now, so there's that. What all do you have here? Splashy fun from splashing in the pool. Slight, sprightly spring, smooth sipping, blessings of self-care fresh air, feeling great, and feeling of, of, of the falls. Tell a folklore about a man in a big hat. Oh, that's like way getting the relationship up. Like, holy crap, that like jumped up. Yeah, it's been a few hours. Let's go ahead and go check back on the temple. And it's right here. 
Oh, that's right. I have to click on it. Check back soon. Okay. Well, I come out here and uh, go here. Like, I look at this beautiful, majestic, like... Oops. Ooh. Come down here. There we go. Oh, whoa. There's a tree in the way. That is like a beautiful view. That's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Maybe get her from this side because I can't remember. Oh, the logo's on the right. That's right. Alrighty. Got some beautiful thumbnails there. Is it open? <gasps> it's open! Clear path of machete. Go, 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 go. We must find the last treasure. I mean, we've already come this far. I mean, come on. Uh, heal the hurt capybara. Uh, creature runs away, notices something shiny in the water, and fishes out a prize. That's nice. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's almost time for me to go to bed. You know, a whole whomp in 8.45. I'm so old. <laughs> oh my god, I was at work today, and while I was at work, I had, um... Yeah, it's a little bit of story time. I have a, uh... Most of my coworkers are around the same age as me, probably plus or minus about five years. Um, so the oldest is probably about... Uh, I mean, not all of them, but I mean, like, the good majority of the people I generally hang out. It's plus or minus of about five years. Um, and so we got onto the topic of hoverboards, and we were sitting there talking about it, and I'm like, they, and one of them mentioned about how hard it is to actually ride a hoverboard. You have to keep in mind, all of us are in our, like, late 20s now, and I started thinking about it, and I just looked at this, those freaking eight-year-olds, like, get on it and, like, zoom around, like, whatever, and then I realized, I was like, Oh my god, I'm so old. <laughs> People were probably doing that to us when we were like 8 and 10 on our scooters or on our skates or whatever. I mean, even on our cell phones at like 10. Um, okay, that's not true. I, pff, cell phones weren't really readily accessible until I was probably about 15. Um, but I mean, still... The principle of the matter is that people were posing the exact same thing about us when, and I just, I, I'm sitting there, I'm like, oh my god, I'm so old. I can't believe I said that. I can't believe I just complained about kids being on hoverboards. Oh, seriously? We, like, know nothing? What about this one? Oh, why do we know nothing? That one was wrong. Let's see. She's so hungry. Okay, well, compliment his carvings? Oh, perfect. But yeah, anyway, that was just the moral of the story, is that you get old real quick. <laughs> I don't know if that's really a moral to the story, but, uh, yeah. Okay, can we actually, like, examine some of these and not just, what is wrong with you? Examine, thank you. And you can examine that one and examine that one. How many do we know? Oh, two. I mean, I guess that's par for the course. Uh, ooh, that one only has one. And what about this one? Oh, well, none of those. Okay, well, there's at least that. She at least knows that. Uh, we'll try this one. Nope, that was wrong. Blame for the temple dangers. She gained some logic for narrowly avoiding disaster, though. Oh, sweet, and we got it open. Perfect. So we're going to examine this. Is that the only one? Yeah, that's it. Okay. Oh, no, wait, there's another one over here, too. Come on, Lacey. Figure it out. At least I, I probably should do some research to see if there's a skill that likes help, helps determine which ones uh, make it easier or harder to make it through the temple. Uh, pull the right warrior's weapon? Nope. Oh, and she's on fire. Sweet! And you're gonna come down here, you're gonna examine that. 
And that's the only one in here. Right? Yeah, I think so. It is. So it's got to be this one. Just a matter of which one. Really? How about we try the sun glyph hole? Oh, cool. That works. Alright, so we're going to open up this treasure chest. And then we're going to open up this treasure chest. And we're going to see if we have finally completed the collections. One Chaos Relic base. No. Not yet, anyway. We do still have the rare Miskin treasures. Uh, let's see. It does not appear so. Let's just go. I'm going to take a look just to make sure. I figured it would have told me if we did. No, go away. Don't care about the crystals. Nope, we still have the one we still need to find. That is like severely disappointing. Alrighty, well, we're gonna, I'm gonna take her home and kind of beef up her skills. Well, not her sk I don't mean like home home, I just mean like, um, maybe, um, beef up her needs. Oh my god, I cannot speak today. Like, it's like the speech part of my brain just said, just kidding, we're taking a day off. I've been like this all day at work, too. Normally, I don't come home and record. Normally, I do more of my recording on my Fridays and my Saturdays versus, like, the middle of the week. And so, I don't know if it's just my body's exhausted and tired or what, but... Anyway, so I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to take care of some of her needs, and then we will be back. Alrighty guys, so I ended up going through, um, I also ended up going through her inventory and taking out a lot of stuff because it was, like, her inventory was, like, super cluttered with stuff. So, I mean, it still is, but, uh, not nearly as much as it was. So, did you not go to the bathroom? I, you, you got up and you washed your hands. Why did you not use the bathroom? You're, I'm sorry, you're dumb. Uh, I don't think we're going to get um, any food right now. Oh, and it also said that her vacation was ending, so I did extend it a couple more days. Um, but I think we're just going to head right on over to the temple and see if maybe we can find the last uh, froggy, the froggy treasure that we need to find. Because I am determined to finish this in this part. Like, I want to find this frog. This is going to drive me bananas. So let's go ahead, let's get in there, and let's actually find this. Okay, that's nice. Uh, okay, you're going to travel through. Uh, travel through this one. I can't remember what's through here. Oh, the plane crash, that's right. And this this one's already... Do those not reset? Like, I think those only reset like once a trip from the looks of it. So we're going to travel all the way over here. Actually, why don't we just go all the way over here? Perfect. And we will come through here and clear the path with a machete. Please. Quickly. Oh, it's her blessing? Hmm. Lacey was foraging through some fig vines a little too enthusiastically when her machete flew out of her hands. That's nice. Uh, quietly look around. On her way out, a wild-eyed Sim jumps at Lacey and chases her for a while as she serpentines through the jungle. Okay, that's nice. Hopefully we can get through this temple quickly, I'm hoping. What's that? Abandoned artifact. Oh. What did she find? Oh, she just found an artifact-shaped dirt clump. That's nice. That's nice, dear. Alrighty, let's get in here and find this last frog. Because this is going to drive me crazy. We're going to do it. We're doing it. Like, what skill is she raising right now? doesn't say. Oh, this mechanism will unlock the gate. Perfect. Tell a skeleton fun. Oh, 
I'm sitting here looking at my keyboard like, it's one of these buttons. Uh, now you're going to need to examine that one and examine that one, please. Oh, she is working on her logic skill. That's good. So what's left on this one? Confidence. Oh, this mechanism will unlock the gate. Oh, she needs inspiration. Do I have one of those berries in here? I should have. Uh, muse berries, of course. And then you can step onto it with inspiration. And then there's these skeletons and these skeletons. <gasps> oh, and there's a chest in here. Open treasure chest. Please hurry. Please hurry. But the Amiskin, Lacey found some wondrous items in the treasure chest, but the Amiskin gods were angered by her transgression and placed a curse on her. She took an artifact and some adventure gear and put them in her inventory. What? What curse did she get? Sneezing curses of the ancients. She needs to avoid touching friends and cook up a remedy of the ancients before this spreads too far. Find some bone dust and cook up an ancient remedy before this turns into an epidemic. Huh. But what... What happened? Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. Oh, this one. Cool. Sweet. What transgression did she do? Like, taking all the stuff out of here, making millions off of it? Okay, it's not quite millions yet, but... Uh, no, no, that's not it. There we go. Uh, pull the middle warrior's weapon. Sweet! Go open this treasure chest, come on. Let it be here. <gasps> we got it! We did it! Yes! She got the last one. The Sprout Sapphire Gold Frog. Because I can't pronounce the other word. Okay. Go ahead and open that one. Sweet! So we have finally done it. We have finally completed the collection. This is it. We're finally done with uh, Jungle Adventures. So... With this happening, this means that we can actually get ready and geared up for the next Let's Play. I'm super excited. So if you do want to see Lacey make an appearance uh, with a spouse in the uh, next series, uh, let me know down in the comments below. Um, but, uh... Yeah, so I don't know, I don't know what we're quite going to do. I think we might go put some of this stuff in her house and then... Uh, Or maybe, maybe she will make an appearance. I have an idea. I have a few ideas, actually. Uh, but I'll go ahead and I'll think on them for now. But uh, I'm just so excited that we finally found the last one. So I want to go home and, yeah, we're, you know what? Travel home. Screw this. We're just going to travel home. We're going to put it up and we're going to be so excited. And we're going to have the collection be complete. So, oh, crap. She didn't create the remedy, though. She still needs that. Um, so, I mean, we'll have to go back and go do that anyway. Or maybe she can order it off of, like, a computer or something. I'm not sure. I don't think so. But, I mean, she does have the bone dust. But I still had... I wasn't able to figure out how to get that done when, uh... We, um... Is there... No, I can't, like... Okay, what do I do now? Oh, no, no. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Put in inventory. I don't know. Oh, Brew Ermal Remedy. Oh. Hmm. Is there... Is it in... Oh, Remedy of the Ancient. It's right there. I'm freaking blind. Get the Remedy of the Ancients. I'm so excited that we found that. Oh, my God. Yes, eat the whole thing. Sweet, so she was able to dispel the curse. So let's go ahead. We're gonna 
go ahead and place all this stuff out here. So let's uh, let's find out what what she already has. Whoops. So she says, okay, let's start from the beginning. Oh, and she's received a blessing of the ancients from dispelling a curse of the ancients. Kids these days don't know what true joy is, but the ancients they knew joy, and Lacey is now experiencing a bit of that. Yeah, I don't want that one. I don't want that. And I don't want that. And she's got four of those. Do we have that one? Is it that one? The gold calendar plate. Yeah. 32 grand right there. Do we have this one? The gold and turquoise? Yes. We're going to sell that one. All right, let's on let's go into the frogs. So this is the six frogs that we have currently. So that's a new one. I know that one for sure. That's the sprout. Um, what about this one? The bullseye, amazite, am am uh, whatever. The bullseye one. That's what it's gonna be called now, forever, for future reference. Uh, oh, that can go right there. Sweet. So how about we uh, drag this one right there? Perfect. Because I don't think we have that one. So yeah, there should be eight frogs here now. So we can sell all those frogs. Another $26,000. She's like super rich now. The super... Or surfer. Oh my god, I can't speak. Yeah, we got that one. We got the skull diamond, right? That's the sunburst, the striped, the bullseye. Skull diamond, there it is. Yes. We have the skull diamond. We're just going to start selling all these unauthenticated artifacts because I'm tired of looking at them, to be honest. Um, I did have her take care of quite a few of them. I think this is the plate that we don't have. Oh, no, I think it is. The Amiskan Gold Calendar Plate. Yep, that was it. Okay, so this is the one that we're missing. So this one needs to come out. I have no idea where we're going to put it. And then the jewel... I don't know. Uh, we should have that one. We should have one of everyone now. The disc ruby. Um, is that it? Okay, yes. It's just the last one. Oh, of course it is. Um, I think we have one of those, and even if we don't, it doesn't really matter to me. Because um, she can always get another one. She can always make another one. She knows exactly what it takes. So we're going to sell all these. Oh, we definitely need to put out her uh, live plant here. Or her live uh, space squid. That's pretty cool. Let's be honest. Alright, oh, and I think that's it. Except for this one, the jeweled. Do we have the jeweled? Disc ruby jeweled. Yes, we do. Perfect. Alrighty, guys. So this will. this is officially the finale so, although I'm sure you would have already seen that by now, because I'm sure I wrote it in the title. Uh, but anyway, go ahead, leave all your comments, your feedback, and your suggestions all down below, especially what you think we should do with Lacey for the future. Um, if you don't want to see her again, just let me know. That's fine, too. I have no problem creating new sims for new storylines and the like. So, uh, anyway, go ahead, leave your feedback, comments, suggestions all on down below. You can also uh, contact me on all my social media, and that's all linked down below in that description box. Um, easiest way to get into contact with me is on Twitter now. I'm always almost, I'm almost always on Twitter. It used to be Facebook, and now it's Twitter. I think it's because I can actually start getting a following on Twitter. We're on Facebook. Not a whole lot of people were liking the page and everything. Um, you still can do that. Uh, you'll still see different content there than you will on Twitter, um, but it doesn't really matter. Um, I mean, it does, but it doesn't. Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And if you like this series, make sure that you are subscribed. This way you can definitely check out any other series that I will be doing. Um, and thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day, guys. Bye.